It is tough to say who will win. On one hand, we have Grok 3 thinking, which produced this in our previous test, when its competitors produced this. And on the other hand, we have newly released Cloud 3.7 Sonnet, which is literally a one-shot game generator and is causing waves in the AI space. So let's start with Grok and ask it to model a teacup. So I've got the code. Let's run it. Okay. So this is what we have got. It is a proper cup. And most importantly, the handle is connected to the cup, which is usually not the case. But what Sonnet will do? Let's see. So I have high hopes with this model, to be honest. Okay, we've got the response. Let me switch to sculpting mode. Okay, that looks good. But the cup doesn't have a base. And I think that's a saucer. And also the handle is not connected. So comparatively, Grok was better in this. But will that change? Let's move on to the next prompt. Let's ask them to model a supercar. We will send this to both models together and see the responses. Let's see Grok's response and then Claude Sonnet's response. Okay, that looks like a cartoon car. Like a 3D representation of a child's drawing or something. Now let's see what Claude has done. Let's get the code and get rid of the previous one. And that's an error. And a rectangular slab actually. That's not what I expected. Let's give it a try. Let's copy the error and ask it to give an awesome car this time. And to Grok, we'll mention that it has given us a very simple car and we expect better. So let's first look at Grok's response. Okay. It has tried to do something, but it ended up as a curvy cartoon car. Now let's see what Claude 3.7 Sonnet has come up with. So it says that it has made a supercar like Lamborghini, Ferrari, McLaren. Let's see how it is actually. Okay. So this is how a Lamborghini or a Ferrari looks according to Sonnet. Comparatively, I would say it's slightly better response, but still not a very good response. So both models didn't perform well on this. Let's see if they can model Burj Khalifa. Now starting off with Grok, let's see what it gives us. Okay, that is nice. Not exactly what we asked for, but it seems to get the three wings and the staggered levels that Burj Khalifa has. It's good. Not best, but it's good. Let's see what Lord 3.7 Sonnet has come up with. And this is what we have got. From the bottom, it looks like a fidget spinner actually. Comparatively not that great, I would say. So, so far Grok and Sonnet are doing equally good. With Grok having a slight edge, I would say. But I expected a lot from Claude Sonnet. Anyways, let's move on to the final test. And that is, generate a high resolution realistic dragon. Let's start off with Grok. And let's see. Okay. We do see the body and legs, but the head looks weird. So we'll just mention that we were able to identify the legs and body, but head is not like that of a dragon. And now let's move on to Claude Sonnet. Let's get the code and let's see. Oh my god, what is this? I mean, in no way I can justify this as a dragon. I mean like this, is it's a very bad response actually. Let's give it one more try and meanwhile, let's see what Grok has done. Okay, now it has fixed the head. Comparatively, it looks better. Nice. Let's see what Sonnet has done. Clearly, I thought Claude Sonnet will blow my mind, but that is not the case, it seems. Let's get the code. Okay, it has something, it seems. Oh my god, that's awesome. That's an exact dragon, guys. I mean, what else is left? That is an exact dragon. It has the toes, the tail, body. I mean, just look at it. That's an exact dragon, guys. I didn't expect that it would be so good. That is a clear win, guys. That's a clear win. Grok and Sonnet were performing head to head, but this is on another level. So it's clear who is the winner, I guess. It's Claude 3.7 Sonnet thinking. I mean, this model is unbeatable when it comes to aesthetics and design. I think this is worth the like, guys. Come on, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more such awesome content. That's it for today, guys. I will catch you guys in the next one.